let's check your videos sort by most popular what's my most popular video what 5.8 thousand views what is this one year ago must have been a hit topic whoa i, I use bandy cam oh god that that satin is so horrible let's make a remake of this that's actually good quality all right hello everyone today we're going to uh make a video on how to install a mod of bloons tower defense battles but this time it's not recorded with bandicam so it doesn't have that annoying water mic and this time it also is doesn't have s in big static and i'm actually better at youtube so first of all we want to clear all the mods so you want to um, go to right click your boon city battles in steam hopefully you have it in steam wait i have it on steam and then you want to go to local files and then verify integrity of game files you just gotta click that and then that'll actually delete all the mods and make it vanilla um because it basically says oh yeah this one's not supposed to be this and this one's not supposed to be this so let's change it Ooh. so yeah okay that should successfully validate it that means it's perfectly normal that's how you uninstall your mods now to get a mod it's pretty easy you just gotta find a mod you like which could be i don't know you could be from where is it i have so many discord servers uh it could be from this discord server which is jambites discord of fun they have modding tutorials and how to create a mod and how to install mods but uh youtube tutorials or video tutorials are actually easier to understand so first of all you want to make sure the mod you want to install in this case we're going to install the alternate dimensions mod uh make sure it's up to date so this one says 6.5 so we go to steam and it says yep the newest version is 6.5 so that means this one's up to date so you want to click that and it opens why does it open microsoft edge i use chrome i have no idea i need to set my main discord i mean main browser but yeah you see this um data.jet right you just save it wherever you wanna um you could save in downloads i'll just save in desktop so it's easy to find so it shouldn't be that big it's just a data.jet and also there should be okay and yeah okay make sure you read the whole message it says we have to use the textures and audio from the previous link which is this link uh when it loads so we're just gonna make sure okay most mods have textures and audio which you really want to download because if not it's just gonna behave differently but it just looks really weird i would like to download to desktop um just download whatever okay so we'll just wait until it downloads and now it's done downloading i'm gonna put it in the downloads folder because most of you will put it in the downloads folder so we have the data.jet which is what most mods have well all mods have and we have most mods have audio and texture files which is the one we downloaded just now which makes the game uh, much not doesn't look weird but we want to open a new instance of file explorer which is pretty easy we just gotta go open an instance of file explorer by just clicking a random thing and then we want to go to this pc osc want to go to program files times 86 uh, or wherever your steam folder is this is the default uh place so i'm just gonna put default here where is the um, hmm. steam all right steam wait no no not steam i meant steam apps common and they want to go to bloons tower defense battles assets now this is where most of the modding comes into play what you want to go to is you want to bring the other one from downloads you want to put your data.jet here put your data.jet replace the file in the destination so this data.jet behaves as if it's alternate dimensions mod and you want to get the resources just all right you can see the audio and textures are here 
So I can just put audio, replace the file, and then we can have textures. Te I said textures, and replace the file with textures. And boom, we are now done installing the mod. Go back to Steam, and we can now play. All right. And then we'll get to the Bloom CD battles. I would not like that as a replay, but let's skip through the no the old stuff and to test if it worked. Where is it? Quick play battle school. Okay, it's a bit laggy. Uh, and then we'll do practice to make sure it works. You can just go to random uh, thing at like 52, and yep, it definitely worked. Although it might be a bit this okay yeah yeah it definitely worked because as you can see we have the crossbow towers and there's also a fourth slot that is um not hidden i mean not randomized and yeah you can just use um whatever you have and you can play in practice okay no you should not um you should not play single player with other people other real people because it will oh god Oh yeah, okay, 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 don't worry. Um, practice mode uh, in this mod is just like this. They decided to make it so it's basically sandbox. But it's not like this, trust me, uh, in other mobs, mods, usually. Unless they want it to be. But yeah, you should definitely just play with friends. Uh, with the play with friends button. And not um, play with other people. Because you will get banned. And if you don't get banned, um, I mean, if you do get banned when you're f playing with friends, uh, you should read some of these here. It should be a place like help request. No, f frequently asked questions. What are the reasons I got hacked upload? You got you modded data.jet. The Steam account has been flagged or banned in the past. Uh, for Android, your phone is rooted, or you downloaded a modded ha or hacked APK. iOS, your phone is jailbroken, or you downloaded a modded hacked IP dot IPA. And then all of these are the reasons that you could be banned. So that's why. So yeah, thank you everyone for watching this video. Hopefully it's much higher quality than um, the old video. And like and subscribe if you want more probably lesser tutorials but if you want more gaming videos and goodbye